beautiful day. Like, I woke up this morning kind of confused and, like, dazed because, like, I my alarm went off, like, right in the middle of a dream. And, but, like, I woke up, like, I was awake. Like, I woke up, I was, like, wide awake. I was looking at the weather, and it says the high is supposed to be, like, 80 five this week which is wonderful um and then it says the low this week is supposed to be 70 and then on wednesday which on wednesday we're going to finish off the food and wine festival but i'm so excited for this cool weather like literally fall is my favorite time of the year with the leaves and the sweater weather and like getting cozy and drinking coffee i absolutely love it and you don't get really any of that in Florida until like the end of the season really into winter. Fall is kind of like our winter really. Uh, last night um, I had a, I'll, I'll end on this, uh, last night I had a <laughs> mini meltdown um, over something silly but like it was just wedding planning and just me being overwhelmed because it, it was me being overwhelmed over all the decisions and little things and wanting something but like wanting something to go my way but also wanting to make it easier on everyone and then uh, attached to that I felt guilty for making people spend money on things and then on top of that I felt mad that they made me feel guilty and but I didn't know how to handle the situation um and so I literally, like, my first response was just like, okay, fine, whatever, I don't care. Like, it's not worth it getting stressed over, blah, blah, blah. But then when I hung up the phone, or, or when I when I stopped, when I ended the conversation, rather, I stopped and I thought about it. I was like, no, I wanted it to be this way. I asked them months ago that I wanted it to be this way. And I, I, I don't, but I don't know how, how to fix this because mom is super mom. So I called my mom and she was like, what's going on? Explain it to me. And she's like, don't worry, I'll fix it. We'll, we'll deal with it. Da, 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 da. Like she instantaneously, she was like, don't worry, honey, we'll fix it. It's not worth crying about. It's all right. It's fine. Cause my mom is super mom. My mom is awesome. My parents are great. So today was a day. Today, um, we had from the 10.30 show till I think it was the 3.30 show, every single show, there was a large, and I do mean large, like well over a hundred people uh, group. It's kind of like Make-A-Wish, um, but they were like divided into smaller groups and they pretty much conquered Hollywood Studios. I don't think there was a single cast member that worked today that didn't see or hear of them. And typically when we get large groups like that, it, they're in communication with like our leadership so we know when they're coming we know where to put them we know how to prepare for them but I guess this time and they, this group typically does and this time they just decided to wing it so that made that kind of stressful so like around 4 30 I was so just like done I was just like so tired and exhausted um, but like I'm going shopping because I mean retail therapy right I sell these at the Disney store online and I was like I want them and now they're here and now I'm like look at Stitch. Oh my god. So I haven't been down Sunset Boulevard in a while. Probably one of my favorite streets. It's the only street that hasn't really changed much other than that screen over there which you can't really see up oh, there it is. That didn't used to be there, but I have a feeling it's going to have something to do with the Tower of Terror, which also you can't kind of see there in the corner. Um, I have a feeling those are going to coincide when it comes to the projections, um, so that'll be interesting. So I guess you're going to want to be somewhere near the Anaheim Produce Sunshine Day Cafe and Mouse About Town. And I just realized I'm going against the flow because of... <laughs> I want this shirt, and I want this top, and I want this dress. This one's really cute too. I like this one. Guys, too. it's Christmas. 
it's Christy Christmas up in here, guys. It's it's Christmas, like Christmas. I just I can't. I just I just can't. Also, they got more things. Like, did I really need more things? I couldn't decide on this. Now you gotta, I gotta decide on this. So I did some shopping, as you would expect. I got the Ariel phone case, um, I got the candle holder, and I got, surprise, surprise, and then I ended up getting the plate and then the little jar. I'm gonna use the plate and the little jar for my jewelry, of course, candle holder, duh. And then I'm going to, and then the phone case I've wanted for a while now. But I'm gonna save all of this and I'll have it be like a Christmas present slash birthday present to myself. So I'm gonna wait to play with this. I really need to stop doing this. <laughs> Just did the dishes and some leg exercises and my legs feel like jelly. So I did a bunch of squats, did a ton of leg lifts, bicycle kicks as I like to call them. Um, I actually did weightlifting with my work bag and then what I got from the store, which was heavy. And I did weightlifting while I was walking to the car and then when I was walking up the steps. And so even my steps I'm at, oh, I'm not there yet. Oh, I'm 11,000, which is close to my step goal, but. <laughs> 